Hello everyone, happy to see you here and in this video we are going to do a very simple math problem and you're going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. So I don't want you to use your calculator right here because here is the problem 8 plus 8 divided by 2 and in parentheses 1 plus 1. Ok, of course most of you out there are like, yes I can handle this problem, I can handle this, this is basic addition, division, multiplication, right here once more addition, I'll learn this stuff in the third grade so we can easily solve it. But I suggest you go ahead and put your answer down in a comment section. We have three options, A, B and C, and choose one option, what do you think is the correct answer, pause the video and try to solve it real quick, and we will check our answer here in just one minute, it will be really interesting, I swear. Ok, so here is our problem, 8 plus 8 divided by 2 and in parentheses is 1 plus 1. Okay, so here's maybe the main question, I guess. Do we do division first, then addition, then multiplication, or do we do addition first, division, multiplication, or do we do multiplication, addition, division? So as you can see, a lot of combination and a lot of students don't know how to work with this. So for this question, we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem, because obviously whatever order you select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem. And for this question, I have this PMDMC order of operation. This is the main popular order in the world, so every every internet library, scientific graphing calculator like uh, works according to PMDMC. So let's solve it according to PMDMC, it will be really great. So according to PMDMC, I just rewrite this problem real quick, so 8 plus 8, we have divided by 2 and in parentheses 1 plus 1, of course multiplication right here, I write right here multiplication, and I take my red pen, I just want you to understand one really interesting moment, because PMDMC works from the top to the bottom, as you can see, our first step will be like parentheses, so let's work with PMDMC, our first step is parentheses, so as you can see from the top to the bottom, our first step is parentheses. Let's look at our question, so are there any parentheses right here? No, 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 oh, yeah, in the end we have parentheses, which is really great, so we need to start from this step, so right here we have these parentheses, and we all know that 1 plus 1 equal to equal to 2. So this is our first step, and I just wanted to rewrite this problem from the beginning, so 8 plus 8 divided by 2 and times Two. Okay, so from this question we have we have right now this one. Okay, let's go next. We don't have parentheses anymore, so let's go next. The next step is exponents right here. So are there any exponents? So squares, cubes, fourth power, first power. No, I don't see any of those. We have only first power, which is really great. Let's go next. Multiplication, and this is really common mistake right here, because a lot of students say, okay, uh, this is multiplication, so let's multiply it first. But one really interesting moment, multiplication, we need to work with multiplication in one group with addition. So one group with addition, multiplication and, and uh, sorry, in addition, division, yeah? So multiplication and division is one group. So let's look at our expression. So are there any uh, division and multiplication signs? So right here, addition sign, okay. Let's go from the left to the right. Yeah, right here we have division sign, which is really great, and next we have multiplication sign, so this is our case, so this is our moment, right now we need to work with this expression, so addition we go, uh, as you can see later, so before addition we need to solve this expression, but do we do multiplication first, then division, or division, then multiplication, this is a question, and for this question we need to scan what is the first sign from left to right, the first sign from left to right is this division, yeah, then on, on the right hand side we have multiplication, but first sign is this is this division, so we need to divide at first. Let's let's separate it, and right here 8 divided by 2 equal to, equal to 4, and I just want to rewrite all uh, elements from 8 plus from the beginning and times 2. Ok, very simple expression right now, so the last step, as you can see, we still have multiplication, so let's solve this, so 4 times 2 equal to, <coughs> equal to 8, so 4 plus 2 equal to 8, and 8 plus 8 4 times 2, sorry, equal to equal to 16. This is our answer to this question. And if you're talking about an option, this is option option B. So according to PMDMC, our correct answer is option option. So answer option B. This is our our 16. Okay, so if you made this error, I'm happy you made this, because you won't make this again. And of course, a lot of countries, a lot of discussion about this order of operation. For example, if you know about bottomless order, you can easily solve it about bottomless order and write your suggestion into the comment section. This is according to PMDMC, the correct answer is 16. 
Okay, if you want to check this answer, you can easily plug in into like a graphing calculator or like scientific calculator, because if you plug in into like a basic calculator, you know, some of those calculators, you know, are just going to do the problem as you type it in. So they start with addition, division, and so from left to right. I know, I hope you understand, yeah? So if you want to check this problem co correctly or not, you can easily plug in into like scientific or graphing calculator or, or like Wolfram Alpha internet library, really great. And okay, <clears throat> definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. Now, if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain tests, math puzzles, you can easily subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventure. Thank you for your time and have a great day.